Hi, how you doing? Justin here. In this video, we're going to be checking out Albatross by Fleetwood Mac, featuring, of course, the great Peter Green, one of my favorite guitar players of all time. Now, I'm hoping that you've seen the playthrough I did, where I did a little duet of myself. So we're going to be looking at the first of those parts, which is kind of the, the slightly more dominant part, because there's some, a lot of harmony stuff going on in this song as well. Uh, one thing I should mention before we get into the tune is that I'm going to be teaching it all fretted, i.e. without a slide. And on the original recording, there's quite a lot of really beautiful slide guitar playing on it, both as little overdubs in the background and as actually the main part. But I'm going to show you the fretted notes. Um, we're going to be using some string bending and stuff, but where those notes are played are the same positions that you'd want to play it with a slide anyway. So if you want to have a go at doing the slide, I will make a, a note of, of saying, hey, I think this one's played with a slide on the original recording, so it'd be, it wouldn't be difficult for you to uh, convert your slide guitar skills to be playing this tune. So uh, let's get to a close-up and check it out bit by bit. So let's go through this four bars at a time. So actually we start on beat four with the first finger on the fifth string second fret. Just play that one note. Then we go to this little A chord. Nothing on the thickest two strings, seventh fret, sixth fret, fifth fret, fifth fret. And then we move down to a G sharp minor. It's not really a G sharp minor, I'll talk about that more in a second. Uh, nothing on the thinnest two strings, sixth fret, fourth fret, fourth fret, fourth fret. So first finger just barring thinnest three strings are on the fourth fret. Okay, so two, three, four, one, and two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, one, and two, three, four, and one, two, three and four. Okay, and we've got this little melody starting there. Now what's really important is this second chord. It's an A, it's a G sharp minor. It's gonna look probably like a G sharp minor to you, but really because the other guitar and the bass are playing in a low E note, it's actually functioning as an E major seventh sound. So even this A over E, A slash E would be written like that. It's kind of giving it a sus sound, an E sus to an E major seven. And you can add a little bass note thing in there if you're playing it by yourself. Okay, now this little uh, melody part now comes in, it's kind of the next four bars. Got the first finger playing second fret of the fifth string. Then we're going to use third finger. It's a little slide just from a fret below from the third fret to the fourth fret on the fifth string with the first finger. Se first finger, second fret, fourth string, back to fourth fret on the fifth string. Then third finger moves down a string and slides up two frets to the sixth fret. And then just move it all back to the fourth fret. So two, three, and four triplet one and two three four and one and two three four and one and two three four triplet one two three four okay i did that all fairly quickly for you uh guys that cotton on to things but let me go through it a little slower now so we had this then one and two, three, then twice on the fourth fret, then back to the uh, fourth fret of the fifth string, then back to the fourth string, slide up to the sixth fret, and back to fourth fret. Now we've got two notes on the fourth fret of the fifth string. The first one slid into it, and then back to the uh, fourth fret of the fourth string, and then second fret, then back to the fourth fret, second fret on the fifth string, and then finishing on the second fret of the fourth string. So let me just play through that whole section with a little count for you. So two, three, and four triplet. One and two, three, four and one and two, three, four and one and two, three, four triplet. One, two, Three. Now it's like the first four bars again. One and two, three, four and one, two, three, four, one and two, three, 
four and one, two, three and four. This time we go. Okay, so it's very ever so slightly different. Okay, so we've got the first four bars, second four bars we play the melody, then we go back to the chords, the same four bars. Second time, this is the same, but now we go, so sliding up to the 6th fret on the 4th string, 4th fret on the 3rd string, 6th fret on the 3rd string, another slide up to the 6th fret, to the 4th fret on the 4th string, then slide up to the 4th fret on the 5th string, 2nd fret, 4th fret, slide up to the 6th fret all on the 4th string, and back to the second string on the still, sorry, second fret still on the fourth string. Then second fret on the fifth string, fourth fret to second fret on the fourth string. So let me play that uh, last lead line. That'll be the uh, the second time through the melody. So we have one and two, three, four triplet. One and two, three. Four triplet one and two, three and four and. Okay, now I'm going to play you through that whole first section now, which is going to be 16 bars, four lots of four. Okay, so two, three, four, one and two, three, four and one, two, three, four, one and two, three, four and. Two, three, and four triplet. One and two, three, four and one and two, three, four and one and two, three, four triplet. One, two, three, four. Back to the chords. Two, three, four and one, two, three, four, one and two. Four and one. Second time through the melody now. One and two, three, four triplet. One and two, three, four triplet. One and two, three and four and one, two, three, four. Okay, so that would be a kind of, I'd call that an A section there. Let's just talk about the second guitar part there for that A section. Um, it's basically a very, very common a very easy chord progression for the whole song, which is four bars of E, two bars of F sharp minor, and then two bars of E again. So in this case, just it's just play, really playing an E note. I guess harmonically it sounds like an E major, but you'd just be doing this, really, eighth note. So one and two and three and four and, okay? Just playing the root note there. We'd be playing on the E. So two, three, four, one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, two, three, four, four, two, three, four. Then the second fret for two bars, that's the note F sharp, second fret of the thicker string, and back to E for two bars. One, two, three, four, two, two, three. And again, that whole sequence, so E, two, three, four, second bar, two, three, four, third bar, two, three, four, fourth bar, two, three, then to the F sharp, which is the second fret, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, and back to E, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Pretty easy there as a second guitar part there for the A section.